Hi, and welcome to another edition of Your Health with Dr. Christy. My name is Dr. Christy Reisinger, and today I'm gonna to talk about results that were published in the New England Journal of Medicine using the drug semaglutide, which is an anti-obesity medication, also known as Wagovi. And then it's also used for diabetes under the name Ozempic. So this study involved 407 patients. The average BMI was about 40, and the average age was 56. All of the participants said that they had moderate to severe knee osteoarthritis or arthritis of the knees. 82% of the participants were women. The study showed that patients that used semaglutide for 68 weeks, most of them tried to get to the maximum dose of 2.4 milligrams. And those that were using semaglutide lost about 13.7% of their total body weight versus about 3% total body weight loss in patients that used placebo. All patients received counseling on diet and increased activity. They used a scale throughout the study and they found that patients that received semaglutide had lower scores on their pain scale. Using this 100 point scale, patients that were on semaglutide had a 42 point reduction in their pain versus those that used placebo only had about a 28 point reduction in their pain. They also used another type of scale just to follow physical activity, and they found that patients that use semaglutide also were more active. Patients that have knee pain, I see a ton of patients with knee pain in my practice, and obesity or being overweight really is a risk factor for developing osteoarthritis of the knees and for worsening osteoarthritis of the knees. And honestly, we don't have that many tools on our toolbox to treat and alleviate osteoarthritis knee pain. At the end of the day, I don't think this study is revolutionary. We know that for every one pound of weight lost, you reduce four pounds of pressure on the knee. So you can imagine even with a five, 10, 15 pound weight loss that reduces the pressure on the knees tremendously. The reason why these patients had less knee pain is because they were losing weight. But I think this study is important to show that patients that struggle with the disease of obesity, we know have lots of other comorbidities. And this is just another indication of the importance of these medications to help with weight loss because it helps with so many other conditions. You've seen on my channel that these medications help with sleep apnea, the prevention of heart attacks and strokes, they help with kidney disease. And the thought is that not only do they help with weight loss, but they also have an anti-inflammatory effect that's happening. So I'm excited about this study. I think these studies are gonna just continue to come in order to try to convince health insurance companies and to help show to the public the value of GLP-1 medications like semaglutide, also known as Wagovi. Thanks for joining me.